So here, this is the history of Liberia. From this is the history of Liberia from 1822. Eh? So here, as you see here, this is what I demonstrated on the Providence Island where they landed. You can see everything here. This is what they depicted because of what they experienced. They landed January 7, 1822 on the Providence Island on Dozwa, Perseverance Island. Trembe, group people call it Trembe. The, 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 the indigenous call it Dozwa, the Degola. They were so happy, this is what they did. When they kneeled down and put their hands up, they took the dust from the ground here. This is when they were getting down from the ship Elizabeth with their loads. They were so happy. This is what is seen here, as you see. This is what they put their hands up. Praise God, we have reached home. And they took the dust from the ground on the island and said, this is the glorious land of liberty. This is where we belong and here we shall stay. And of course they did that. This is it. You see they took it, taking their load from the ship, went on the island. This is a sample of it. Okay, they left come on the other side here. Here, here, as you see here, they went through a lot of things from America. <coughs> then in Africa, they stopped to Shebru Island, Sierra Leone, and they were denied by the Sierra Leone authority under the governorship of Governor Charles Makate, who became suspicious of political reasons and denied them on the peninsula. So when they came on, the, they got on the island, 1822 on the Providence Island, they were given the go ahead. They came on the mainland and then set to start building, you know, doing their normal work. But then, among every organization, every group, there are some disgruntled people. Some of the indigenous were not happy. So when the men, the settler men went on the farm to get food for their, for their children and wives, they were attacked by some of the indigenous and they used bow and arrow and fight him. You see how he's looking? He said, hey, uh, all the way those Sierra people deny us where well, we are received and welcome happily. They attack us. You see what he did? He had a brother here. It was when this lady, Martita Newport, who came on board the ship Elizabeth, fired this cannon. And a lot of the indigenous died. Because of what she did, the indigenous died and they some of them fled away. Way back some time ago, De December 1st used to be Matilda Newport Day. It was a national holiday. Not until 1980, when Sammy Kanye took over and the government of Liberia abolished, you know, the, the, abolished the, 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 that day. So no more Independence Day, no, no, no more, um, um, how do you call it, Matilda Newport Day in the history of, in the, in the, uh, as a national holiday. So it's an ordinary dinner. Here it is. And then you see the candle around here. Most of some of time, some time ago, when they have an Independence Day celebration, National Day, they have to know one gun salute here. And some of these guns are here to protect the territorial water of Liberia. You know, World War II. The German ship came here, you remember? They came here and we chased them with our guns. This is what, what they were doing here. Now, <coughs> this is how the black were like from the Gori Island to America. They tied them with rope, chain, you see the chain? They put them on board a the ship. They stay so many months on the, on the sea. If you die, they put you in the water, in the sea. The big fish, the whale eat you. This is how they were like. Then, when the settler came, 1822, they formed a government, national, you know, uh, Commonwealth period. Thomas, this is Thomas Buchanan, who was the, gov who was the governor of Liberia. Thomas Buchanan. From there, then uh, 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 the, 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 the settlers, the people in America, and the people in Liberia, the Liberian people, had our independence. Uh, July 26, got our independence. July 26, 1847, we had our independence. We are the first African black country in the whole of Africa, first independence republic in Africa. Liberia is the one. Now you see here, that is uh, when the first, first president the democratically elected president of Liberia and the democratically elected president of Africa, Joseph Jenkins Roberts from America. He's from Norfolk, Virginia, the USA. 
he has an African black a background. His mother was an African. The white, their father was white. He was a first president. Now you see here, most of the thing you see here, like I was telling you on, on, the, on the bus, most of the they say Liberia, that's small America. The French people say Petit America, Liberia. In Liberia, most of the thing you see is Liberia, is America. Our flag. Listen to me. I pledge allegiance to the flag of Liberia and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. It's the same. So everything. In Liberia, we have Maryland. In America, Maryland. In Liberia, we have Mississippi. In America, Mississippi. In Liberia, we have Virginia. In Virginia, we have Louisiana. We have Georgia. Look, any different there? Again, we are small. But we are all there. Just right across the road, you see the U new U.S. Embassy, fresh one, the largest embassy in the Republic of Liberia. Serve the people of Liberia. The United States government and the Republic of Liberia, we are together. They come to our need, they come to our cries, and they do a lot of stuff, they do a lot of so many things and continue to do it. Like I told you about the island, Providence Island, the American government take over. The uh, former American ambassador, uh, Michael, Mc Michael McCarthy, signed a term with the, um, uh, with the Liberia government, with the former president, George, Manner we are, but we tap on one on Grala we are that the country the traditional near call. But we tap on Grala we are that his tradition that his traditional name from the southeast. They signed agreement with the, with the government of Liberia. So the island is under the control. They are going to reform, transform the island, build a lot of things, then later on turn it to a national government for touristic purposes. So this is the statue of Joseph Jacob Robert. I'm also the tour guide for some of the American embassy they have. I brought the people here the last time, the Americans were here, and I told them, Liberia, America was not the first to have produced, to have produced the first African-American president, but Liberia, not just objecting rapper. We were the first to have produced the first African-American president. Mm -hmm. It was not Obama, though we are in Africa. But then everybody said, oh, I'm going to do that. That's it. And that, that's not true. And then so, yeah, this is just objecting rapper. That's true. That's true. Yeah. Is yes. it from North for Virginia, the USA? Yeah, exactly. That's simple. Appreciate it. As you can it. see here, this is the flag. After we got our independence, a national flag day, August 24. This one with the host our flag. Every year is being celebrated. And Joseph Jenkins Robert is going March 15. Was a birthday. It's a national holiday. That day is a national holiday too. Here you see the flag of Liberia here, like that of the United States of America. Only one star. It's red, white, and blue. But the star is turning. The, the, the lone star of Liberia. This is it. This is okay. it. Do you have any question? Anybody have question, please? The white, the white, the white uh, color stands for purity. The red stands for valor, the blood our people share. And the blue stands for the damn dark continent of Africa. And of course, the star stands for the moon star of Liberia. <coughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. So, so that's it there. So, uh, 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 the, the butchers, uh, 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 what she's saying, uh, uh, what she's been taught is that the star is and the, the star represents the lonely country in Africa. Yeah, the lone star, the lonely country. The, 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 the star represents the lonely country in Africa. Yeah, Africa. So, the, the blue that's dark tree represents the dark continent of the Africa. The dark continent of Africa. So, that star represents the first because country within first Africa. To independence country in Africa. That's it, yes. That's it. Okay, let's come on. That, that's powerful, man. Delight, appreciate delight, it, brother. Delight, appreciate the energy. So, appreciate it. So, here again, we come to phase two. Of the monument, the phase three of the monument. Here, you see here, this is iron. Iron is one of the main exports of Liberia. We have iron ore company, Namco, way back, now Asala Metal, and all over Liberia we have iron ore. We have iron ore, we have we export diamond, gold, we export timber. We have the second largest rubber plantation in the world, as you know that. <coughs> the first is uh, uh, in Malaysia, the first rubber plantation is in Malaysia. Now Malaysia is, as I learned, is engaged into palm product. So probably in the near future, Liberia might be the first, the first largest rubber plantation in this. So here, you see here, this is Piazza. 1461. 1461.
the British were here on the coastal line. 1461, the Portuguese were here. You all remember Pedro de Central? Pedro de Central. Huh? Mm -hmm. uh, 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 how do you call it? Uh, one, um, Pedro de Central and, 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 and some other guy they were on the coastal line. The Malagueta pepper, the green coast. They, mal they discovered Malagueta pepper, the green pepper on the coastal line. Mm -hmm. yeah. And later on, the settler came in and of course, the, 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 the Portuguese, everything where that was. From now, if you go to Grancess, there's some a, a, a rag, huge rag, rag in Grancess on the beach. They call it, uh, 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 what is the name? Uh, uh, Fagate. They have writing Portuguese written on it. It rained 24 hours, the rain cannot go under. But the people over there, they didn't know the meaning of the right up over there in Portuguese. These are some of the things. Now here, you see here, this is fruit basket. Liberia is a, fat, it's a very rich country, fertile country, good for agriculture. You see the woman with a the, with the, with the, with the, with the, uh, uh, fruit basket, it's rich. Liberia possesses 45% of tropical Africa rainforest. There are certain animals in Liberia you cannot find in any part of the world, in Africa. Any part of the world for that matter. I'll give you that story. Pygmy, pygmy hippopotamus can only be rare in Liberia and Sierra Leone. When they built this structure here, Duca Hotel, eh? President Tottenham, when they were about to open it, President Tottenham invited most of the African leaders. He invited Halil Salasi of Ethiopia, Jomo Kenyatta of Okinia. And they came to Liberia, they stopped here. Then he took them on the farm. In Totota, I think you're not on the highway. He had he had zoo there, and when they got there, they saw they went in the zoo. They saw the pigment hippo, baby one. Ali Salasi was interested in it, and Jumbo Kinyata was interested in it. And they went there. They said, "Oh, uh, brother comrade, can you give us one of them?" He told them, "No, it cannot be. They cannot grow in any other country besides Liberia and Sierra Leone." Then you know what they said? What they told him? They said. What's so special about Liberia? Tonma told them that if you carry them, they will die in less than 24 hours before, because the atmosphere here is different from that of there. They enjoy mm. it. They say, oh, you just don't want to get They say, okay. He packaged them. He packaged them and sent them. And sent it by them, they carry it. Less than 24 hours. When they got to, when, 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 when Ali Salasi, who reached it, less than 24 hours, it died. Jomo Kinyata, who, less than, they sent it like, but that time, it was not telephone. They used to do the telephone. Something they said, it's too high. It's Liberia is a special country. We have it, we have it, and I continue to tell the people that we have the virgin promising tourism industry. We have a very promising and virgin tourism industry that some of them are not being tapped on. You go to Grand there, there's a village that a town that they call it Shemei Dobole District, where the human being turned to stone. They tell Sodom and Gomorrah, the human being turned to stone. You go to Riverside, something part of Riverside, there's a footprint on the rock. All of us, Fort Markham, we don't wear the same sizes, but you feel that it will feel neat. You go to Grand Cruz Sastan, Tremway Island. These are what we have here. So, ladies and gentlemen, any question? Okay, so, so let me let. Uh -huh, yeah. Just to add up to what you were talking about with the Lamco issue of the Iron Old, Lamco. It's a uh, Liberian American and Swedish, Swedish mining Swedish. company. Uh -huh. Yeah. So Namco is a Liberian American Swedish. Swedish mining company, and they were founded in 1955. Yeah. So when they when they came to to Liberia, the founder this company needed to transport iron ore because we reach with so many iron ores by then. So that way they came in and they built it in Nima. They had to transit iron ore to Nima County. So. That's a little information on Lamco oh, no, there. Yeah, for them, for short, we call it Lamco. Lamco. Yeah. So let, Excellent, let, brother. Appreciate so let's look over there now. Let's look right here. We cannot go in. This is a Duca Hotel. It's called, they call it Duca Palace Continental, Intercontinental Hotel. This was the first five-star hotel ever built in Africa. It was built by the Pan-American Airways. Pan-American. World War II, when World War II, Started. They started fighting World War II when World War II ended. Panam was flying all over Liberia, Africa. Panam airplane was flying all over Africa, but they never had any country 
and never trust any country beside Liberia, where they are cruel to sleep. So they went and, and consulted Liberian government. The drop of the government of Liberia was able to give them that place to build it for their crew and as a hotel. Oh, that makes Very sense. Very five star hotel. In this hotel, Jumbo Kenyatta, most of the African leaders enter the hotel. You see the footprint of President William V. Estoman turned to swimming pool in there. You see Michael Jackson, you hello, hello? Michael Jackson being here. I'm hey. sorry, I don't have the voice to sing. Hey. But Michael Jackson <laughs> was in this building. He sang Liberian Girls. I think those are like, there, there he sang the song inside yes, there. Yes, yes. Jomo Kiyata, Ali Salati, eh? uh, uh, um, um, the late, uh, 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 the, the Uganda president, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Idi Amin Dada, yeah, yeah, yeah. he swam in a place with a pistol on his side. He was swimming while the pistol was still on his side. It was in there. Queen well. Elizabeth had all been here. A lot of African leadership been here. They are in the hotel. there. And the yellow structure you see, that's a navigation tower to control the ship, direct the ship on the sea. But now it's been destroyed. Currently, it's under the supervision of Libya, Gaddafi. They started doing something here. Unfortunately, Gaddafi died. But still, it's under the control of Libya, uh, a company in Liberia. If you want to go there, they want to rebuild it. And so, so far, so far. Yeah, uh, Gadda uh, the Gaddafi so, was assassinated. Yeah, Gaddafi it was, seemed like he died of a natural cause. Or Gaddafi something. was uh, killed. Yeah, assassinated. But it's under the control. So if you want to go in there, I bring people here. You come here, you have to ask for permission from the authority. They have their security here, money the place. So where we are again, this is the highest point to the to the to the west. That's Sierra Leone. You can use about five hours. Well, you see uh, water, yeah. sea drive on the ocean. You reach the Sierra Leone. Then from here to the east, that's uh, the, the, how they call it, the La Côte d'Ivoire. To the north, that's uh, the Republic of Guinea. And to the south, that's the Atlantic Ocean. For the 3,000 square miles of Liberia, land total land area, with 350 coastal lines. Good marine tourist, mar uh, uh, marine tourism we have. We have the best surfing area in Africa, in Liberia. Grand Cayman County, Lake Piso. This is it. So ladies and gentlemen, any questions? Yes. You can see that there. You can see Morovia City Center. You can see the city center. Yeah, any question, mommy? Yes. Why was Marcus Garvey banned from Nigeria? Huh? Why was Marcus Garvey banned from coming to Liberia? Oh, Marcus, Marcus Garvey. Mm -hmm. <laughs> was he banned? I guess that's the other. I, just, I guess that's the, the, the first question. And then, if so, <laughs> why? Well, <laughs> politics. That's African politics, anyhow. And um, you know. Uh, Marcus Garvey fought for, you know, the blacks, and so to do for the yeah, blacks. Yeah, he wanted blacks to come back to Africa. Yes. That was the main purpose of the movement. Yes. But, uh, they, you know, that, that, that politics, mommy, I don't know where that one came from. Don't I don't know, no. Okay. They didn't like his way of thinking. Yeah. yeah. About you know, nation building. And, and, and obviously, he was doing well. He was ed educating the young people, progressive to be, you know, mm -hmm. to be in control of their own land, mm -hmm. instead of whatsoever. But the Western people didn't like it. So, you know, they have power over the black, some, like in Liberia here. Anything that, that to do, they will, they will go against it. That's it. But it was later on, the progressive people like Marcus, the late Baker Matthew, Tobana Tipote, the late Emon Sawyer, eh? most of the guys, eh? due to the Trumpler Mason, all of them, they saw that it was to do. Then the progressive people started coming up. If you all remember the Rice Riot, April 14, 14 1979. 19, uh, uh, 1979, I was among some of those. I was, was demonstrating on LU, we started marching here and there, and we came right here. Right here on, on Gala Street, where the uh, 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 LPP party was there, uh, you know. The, 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 oh, sorry, no, the, 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 the headquarters of PAR. Uh, PAR headquarters, yeah, PAR headquarters. Yeah. Then the late, uh, one, one, one old man, uh, Albert Port. The the late Abba Paul, he was, he was moving from place to place. When they sent <coughs> the rice riot, we used where they have the police station now. There was a, the police station was there, but it was not modernized. It was a black, you know, almost like zinc shop, and where Mark, the late, uh, uh, the police director, uh, who was uh, uh, Vanny Dempster, he was the police director. They trying to stop us from, from demonstrating, but still, we're still going ahead. And we came all the way around here, and the President Talbot sent for a jet bomber 
from Guinea. Second to recently, and it was only the jet bomb when it passed our first time experience when it passed the whole ground was shake. All of us are running away. And then uh, uh, just to add up uh, the, uh, what actually led to the rest riot uh, that was um, in the government of you know, person in tournament that uh, they wanted to increase, increase. The, 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 the price of 100 pounds of beggar rest from 23 dollars to 27 dollars. They gave us back up Matthew, you know, as a progressive and a, and a, 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 a protester, he refused and said if if, 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 if the price you know, should increase, that is the quantity also, the quantity also you know, should increase. So there were, you know, uh, the problem came from them. Uh, at that time, we have only you know, one you know, broadcasting system, the ELBC. ELBC. Yeah, so when, when the communication went through, uh, PA didn't receive the communication, the Progressive Alliance of Liberia didn't Liberia. receive the, the, the communication. So they took the street that morning while protesting, and then the government sent police to cut off the protest, but then the guys refused. Uh, in order because they needed you know, freedom for Liberian. Uh, uh, Gabriel Bagua Mati said, uh, rest is the stable food of Liberian. So uh, uh, you cannot increase it without, uh, you know, without the quantity of it being increased. So we took the screen and at that point of time, they arrested Gabriel Bagua Mati, they placed him behind by, and then uh, after a few times, uh, they, they, they get him freed, and uh, we went on up to you know, the, the 1980 could detach before you know, uh, we enter into a civil crisis. So that's it. Uh, any question? So I think that's about all. You can more? leave from here and go to the restaurant to have your lunch, whatsoever, to the Unification Square. Then I'm going to show you some other things at the area. Appreciate it, brother. Great presentation.